All right, hey guys, back again with another video. Uh, today we're gonna be talking about water storage. I have these covered up right now with the trash bag just to keep them kind of clean. But um, yeah, so recently I've been kind of stocking up on water, uh, just mainly just for the sole purpose of clean drinking water. And I know I haven't made a video in a while. I've been really busy, and then I was planning to make one like this past week, but it's been raining every single day, and so I just haven't came out come out to make one. <clears throat> but yeah, today's topic is, is uh, water storage. It's, it's really simple and really straightforward. But as you can see here, I have these uh, big jugs. Most of these are between like, uh, I think these are all six gallons. There's one in the end here, that's a seven gallon. Basically all I've been doing is just every few months, every few weeks, I go to Walmart and I buy another jug, they're like 17 bucks a pop. And I fill them up with water. <clears throat> and as you can see, I kind of wrote, wrote some dates on them here. Uh, from what I read in the CDC website, you can store water from uh, just regular tap water for about six months without having to worry about any kind of like bacterial growth or anything. Um, I know the CDC is usually a bunch of lion fucks, but uh, I trust them on that. Although I, I've, I've been changing them out every about four months just to give myself a bit of buffer. <laughs> Throw the fuck away. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, sorry, it's my retarded sister. Um, yeah, so as you guys can, as you guys can see, I've just been picking up jugs recently. I think uh, you know I see a lot of people talking about water filtration, which is great, but um, I think you should also be storing some water yourself as well, just because um, it's it's nice to have that kind of backup supply. Whether if some shit happens, like whatever kind of natural disaster, anything. <clears throat> and you have no access to water, if you can filter it, that's great, but if you have nowhere to filter from, uh, you're kind of you're boned if you didn't stock up prior. I'm lucky enough that I live like right next to my town's reservoir, so I guess if I really needed water, I can just walk there and grab some. But I mean, I've been doing this in the meantime. Uh, I'm not sure how many more I'm gonna get. I'll probably be pretty comfortable at maybe 10 jugs, but I figured I'd share this in the meantime. Um, if you're not stuck, stocking up on water, you should be. And this is a pretty easy, effective way to do it. I keep these outside. I cover them up so birds don't shit on them. And then um, just, you know, check on the dates, make sure the water's still fresh. That's all, that's all for now, guys. Um, if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them down below. I'll probably link my Discord server or my Instagram if you want to follow me on there or join or whatever. I don't care, but I'll be back soon with another video.